Hi, this is Deb from Business Building Shortcuts and today I'm going to show you one of my favorite tools. When I'm creating a new website, landing page, or blog post, sometimes I want to match a color exactly to one that I've found elsewhere on the internet. Or I want, I've want i created a page and I want other pages and pieces of the page to use those same colors. But I just don't know what those colors are. This is a tool that I use on my PC and it's called Color Pick. It's going to let you go to a website and figure out exactly what color is being used. It's going to let you grab the hex code, the hexadecimal code, which is what you would put into your color system in order to recreate that exact color. You can create your own colors, you can adjust the colors, and it will also identify you for for you web safe colors which are colors that typically look the same from browser to browser it's you can find it on iconico.com color pick and it's free if you're a Mac user then you want to search uh, color picker Mac for Mac friendly color pickers it will work somewhat the same way let me show you how this works here we are at iconico which is where you can download the color pick software for PC and just let's just take a quick look at the things it can do. These are all of the features. You're going to be able to pick any color from the screen which will let you identify exactly the codes that you would need to put into your HTML editor or into your um, web paint software such as Adobe Photoshop or other software in order to exactly match a color that you have found that you really like and you are going to be able to adjust things like the hue, saturation, value, make all those kinds of adjustments. You can use it to adjust different colors as well as to identify web safe colors which are colors that are easily uh, used on the internet and usually stick pretty true to what you think they might look with. So let me just show you how easy it is to identify a color on a web page. Right, I've got my color pick open and I brought it up here now to show you what this looks like. It's going to show me many different web safe colors, green, blue, magenta, and it will allow me to show to select from all these different varieties of web safe colors quickly so that I could enter those colors into my HTML editor. For example, if I wanted to use a brick red, these would be different colors of a brick kind of red that I could use. But let's say that I had found a color that I really wanted to match that was on a web page. All you need to do is open your color pick and create a new palette. So I'm going to call this test 3. Call my palette test 3. And now you'll notice that as I move my cursor around the page, it's going to show down here, it's going to show a larger um, magnified view of the part of the page that I'm I'm on that I'm hovering over and then right in here the color it's going to show the color and it's going to give you both the decimal color and the hex color it's also going to give you tons of other information right here so watch those as I move my cursor around this actual web page see how I'm hovering over the dark blue and you can see now that it's got the codes for that color dark blue or if I go down here to this lighter blue on the on the download button it will show you that or perhaps even this lighter blue that falls into a pattern and you can use the magnifier to get exactly the part that you want of that pattern which color you want to collect so what I want to do is just grab a couple of quick screenshots of what these colors are let's say that I really like this color blue right here all I would need to do is hover over it until the color um, is exactly what I want both in the screen below in magnify but also under color there in the center of color pick while you're hovering over it and you've gotten the correct one chosen with your new palette open you would just put control G for grab did you see how it it turned into grab here showed up and now that color is locked in under your test 3 palette if you want to collect another color from this page you would just move into the next little teeny chip section highlight that 
and then you can see as you move around it too changes. Let's say I wanted to grab that orange color. There it is. I've got that so I would just put control G and now it has grabbed the orange color. And you can see when I move back and forth between them they're changing down here in this section so that I can see the different information, both the decimal color or the hexadecimal color code as well as the larger pieces of information down here. So there are a number of ways you can enter it into your software, whichever application you're using. However they need to get this information, you now have that available for them. It's just that quick and easy to use Color Pick. So if you have a PC, go out and grab this so that you can start matching the colors that you want. And then if you have a Mac, remember to go and search for Color Picker Mac. Now go have some fun with this in creating your new web pages. Okay, if you found this helpful and you like these little tools, pop on over to our blog at businessbuildingshortcuts.com where we have a lot more videos and other informational tips that will help you to slash the time that it takes to figure out the different technology and systems that you need to know to get your online business running fast.